So after a month of holding up foreign aid to Ukraine, hardline Republicans in Congress lost that fight over the weekend. One member of the Colorado delegation, Democrat or Republican, voted against the aid packages to Ukraine, Israel, and Taiwan. And that was Republican Congresswoman Lauren Boebert. Boebert opposed the $60 billion for Ukraine, $26 billion to Israel, and with also with humanitarian aid for civilians in Gaza, and then $8 billion for Taiwan. Boebert and other members of the far-right Freedom Caucus the voiced the strongest order. opposition for continuing aid to Ukraine. They've been trying to hold the that House up in exchange in for funding border security. Boebert accused Republican House Speaker Mike Johnson and other Republicans who voted to support that aid package of caving to the Democrats. This is embarrassing. Uh, we, do we deserve the majority? I think um, our Republican platform and policies absolutely deserve to have the majority gover governing voice uh, in, in our government. But unfortunately, we have leadership that capitulates to the Democrat majority in the Senate and in, um, to President Biden. The strongest opposition to aid for Israel came from some Democrats, but all of Colorado's Democrats in the House voted to support the aid package for Israel. They now go on to the Senate, where it could pass as soon as tomorrow.